All right, thanks, Emily. A mobile firefighter was injured this morning fighting another house fire likely caused by lightning. This fire on Dorchester Drive in the Inverness neighborhood that's off of Hillcrest Road. Heavy smoke covered the area. Firefighters were able to pretty quickly contain the fire to the back of the house. The firefighter was injured when a piece of sheetrock fell on him, but we we're told his injuries are minor. In North Baldwin County, a big tree toppled in Bay Manette, but luckily there wasn't too much damage in that area. News Five's Cassie Fambroge has more from Dolly Street. The day started out wet and windy here in Baymanette, where the wind actually claimed a really big tree right here behind Wright's Auto Parts. I'm going to show you this tree down here. It was ripped clear out of the stump, and of course it had some tree rot in it, and these winds were able just to topple this tree. City workers were able to get here pretty quickly and get any limbs that were in the roadway out of the way. Just across the street from the down tree, there's a couple of tree limbs out and a sign that was blown down, but that was about it in Baymanette, luckily after all that wind and rain this morning. Now, we did find a family at the grocery store who said the extra day off from school was going to be a little fun for them. And I'm fixing to go into Piggly Wiggly and get some chicken, and we're fixing to go to the house. This is going to be like an extra day off for you. What are you going to do? I don't know how you just sit home and play my Xbox. And city officials got on scene very quickly to remove this tree and any of those limbs that were in the roadways here around Bay Manette. Reporting on the Baldwin County Beat, Cassie Fambro, News 5. Well, today's storm left quite